This is a cool angle. Good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning. It is March 17th and it's St. Patrick's Day, so happy St. Patrick's Day. I am not wearing any green. I actually look like Winnie the Pooh, I think. I'm wearing a red sweater, yellow pants. It's always freaking freezing in this house, so I'm always like in sweater weather. So hopefully when I go to LA, my wardrobe will be a little bit more appealing because I'm always in sweaters here, but anyway. March 17th. As you guys saw, I woke up at 1.52 today, which I'm really excited about. Today, I think I'm doing legs. I did cardio yesterday here at home. I just got on the elliptical for 25 minutes. Things are going well. Neck pain is still there. I am going to the PT tomorrow. Hopefully she can give me a little bit of relief and talk me through some things that I could do at home for myself. And hopefully I can start seeing her a couple times a week so I can start feeling better. So plan for today. I have a lot of things to do here at home. The new challenge has been open. The new challenge is starting August 4th. All the details will be provided in the link below in the description box. So if you have any questions or anything, feel free to ask below or just click on the description box. But we will be starting on April 4th. Everlast and Pretty Fit are also joining me once again. It's gonna be bigger and better than last time. So I hope you guys join us. So a lot of you wanted the recipe for the protein ice cream I made. I'm going to kind of switch it up a little bit and make that for breakfast. I'm not sure if I wanna make like a ice cream smoothie bowl type thing. I'm just gonna get creative as I go. So join me, I hope it comes out good. So I'm going to insert the recipe right here and I will see you guys in a little bit. even sure if I showed the finished product to you guys <laughs> but I ate it it's done if I didn't show it I'll make sure to show it here but I will show the video by the recipe obviously and I'm really full I'm gonna clean up this kitchen because it's a disaster okay we're back sorry about that my battery died I'm not sure where I left off but finished eating finished cleaning the kitchen and now i am working doing some work i'm editing that video so i can send it over to pretty fit so they can post it on their ig for that recipe and i'm working on some challenge stuff working on the crops hopefully it'll be done and i can have the pre-order by the time i'm in la hopefully if everything goes as planned and what else i'm gonna go do legs today i think when taz gets out of work because he got a new job he's out at five nothing much is happening today just i'm doing a lot of busy work behind the computer i have to rent a car for la if you guys don't know i'm headed to la april 7th through the 17th I'm going for 10 days. I'm gonna go with Brittany Lesser, uh, Robin Gallant, Nikki Blackader, uh, Emily Duncan, Elle uh, Chaplow, and um, who am I missing? I'm missing one person, who am I missing? Oh, me, duh. Oh, and then Ariana Dantone as well. So I'm so, 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 so excited. I know that we're gonna have a meetup at some point. I don't know details just yet. There's gonna be a lot of people to kind of accommodate. So that's exciting. It's my first meetup, <laughs> so I don't know, like, <laughs> I feel like I'm gonna be the one taking the pictures for the girls. <laughs> I'm like, I'll take your picture. <laughs> but yeah, I'm really excited about that. I have to rent a car for us and kind of figure out who's coming when so we can go pick them up and we don't have to waste money on like transportation getting us to the Airbnb and stuff. So I wanna get all that organized. And yeah, so that's it. I think I'm just gonna um, get work done and then I'll catch you guys hey in guys. a guys, it's now about 2.45 and I've just been in front of my computer working. But I just got an email from Evan over at Pretty Fit and they've just released this, this new stack, which is pretty cool. I'm gonna share it with you guys before I forgot because I probably will. So this is what it is. It is called the Lean Green Protein Stack. And a lot of you have been asking me about the greens and the protein. Where you get a pack of protein, the greens, and an omega, because which is what I take every single day. You can pick between chocolate and vanilla, and then the greens is what I put in my oatmeal. And it's usually a 180, but it's on sale for 125 for all of this, which is pretty cool. You get 20 packets of the protein, which I really like because if you're like traveling, I'm not sure what's happening here. If you're like traveling, you can just take the packets. You get 
30 servings of greens. I put that in my oatmeal or your pancakes. It can, it's not like a green flavor. It's more like a berry flavor, which I really, really enjoy. And then you get omegas and that's like 60 count. I take two a day, so it's like a 30 day serving. Again, this is awesome, 125. And you can use my code for 20% off. So yummy 20, the code will be here on the screen and it'll also be in the description box below. That'll be on sale, I think from today the 16th through well, April 16th. So if you are thinking about buying protein or any supplements, uh, jump on that and use my code for a little bit more discount. Six and a half hours later. Hey guys, just got to the gym. It's a little bit late, 6.30 and I'm never really here this late, but waited for Taz to get home. I had my pre-workout right before we left. Probably should not have done that. And it wasn't like small either. I'll insert a little video clip right here, but it was pretty much just like a lavish wrap with four ounces of turkey and a bunch of coleslaw. And that was it, but I feel really cool right now. But right now I'm on the treadmill, uh, warming up for about five minutes and I am doing legs today. My neck is severely tight right now. Even holding the camera hurts really bad. So I'm gonna see what I can do. I'm gonna attempt to do what I can and go that was very different than last time it was a lot of talking she was just you know getting to know me really and then we had like 20 minutes left so she did a couple things had me lay down on a foam roller had me do like eyes wise T's. it was a lot more therapy type stuff more working on my muscles a lot of correctives which I'm happy about she gave me a couple things to do told me to head over to Staples right away and to pick up a, a wireless keyboard and a wireless mouse and something to pop my computer on because 
obviously I work on my laptop and I'm like this all day, which I knew. I always tell Taz that I always find myself like, you know, work with your posture like nice and straight and then I always find myself like this. <laughs> so I'm gonna go do that now. Um, but she did give me this foam roller. It's a lot softer than mine that I gotta work with. She gave me that. She gave me this cold pack to put behind my head when my headaches get really, really bad to kind of freeze the nerves. Then she also gave me this to put inside my pillow so I can go to bed because I don't really talk about it, but I don't sleep very well because I just don't get comfortable. My headaches are severe, especially at night, and it takes me a long time to fall asleep. So that's that, hopefully that all works. Then they gave me nine appointments to go to, which was nice, they just kind of like printed them out and I was like, wait, I'm gonna be gone for three of those appointments, so we changed them. I'm gonna go see them twice next week and twice the week after that. And then it's LA, and then I'll be back on the 19th for them, and then, so that's that, I'm happy. She was really nice, very thorough in her explanations, which I like, I like to learn when I'm doing things and through the process, so I'm very happy. I'll be back, when I'm back. I'm back on the 22nd, so next Tuesday, and I'm gonna be working with somebody else. So I'm gonna be working with two ladies, and they're gonna share me, so hopefully, this'll be good for me. <laughs> she did say that she won't tell me that I can't work out, so she said if it hurts, don't do it, if it doesn't, you're free to do it. She said, I'm a personal trainer. I know what looks good and what doesn't in terms of form, so I can do it. But I think I'm gonna take it easy. One more week, maybe light, light weight, a lot of repetitions, we'll see. I'm in a good mood. I think that I can only get better from here, right guys? So off to Staples first, then off to the gym to do my cardio. So change of plans, I walked in there and I was gonna buy the keyboard and mouse, but then I was like, they're kind of expensive. So I looked them up on Amazon and there was like a bundle for like 20 bucks for a mouse and a keypad, or <laughs> keyboard. So I'm gonna go and buy them on Amazon and I'll get it tomorrow, so I'll do that instead. I'm also gonna go do cardio at home because the dogs are home and I kind of feel bad because they've been home for a while by themselves. So I'm gonna go just go home, do some cardio at home, eat after cardio and then some work and then get my eyebrows done i have to leave at like around two so i'll have time to get some work done and then head out at two so that's the plan see you guys in a little bit bye 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 hi just finished some cardio i took the dogs out to get walked i made some breakfast here we have some french toast with two servings of egg whites and some muscle butter I used the cake donut today because that's what I was feeling or the glazed donut because <laughs> that's what I was feeling and I'm gonna do some work now yeah so I just wanted a quick update uh, my hair is a disaster I want to shower before I head out um, I'm gonna order the keyboard and stuff now before I forget so eat this work at the same time and I'll catch you guys later hi guys so showered got ready and we just got a package in the mail I'm gonna open it with you guys I gotta leave in like five minutes, but I got really excited for this package. Ooh. Let's see what it is. Oh boy. So we got food cake, peanut butter, ooh, chocolate chip cookie dough, peanut butter, chicken cream. Ooh, that'll be Ooh, I'm gonna take one of these right now because I don't think I ever had a cookie dough. So I'm gonna have a cookie dough. What's this? Ooh, cookies and cream, fit elite. I'm so excited. Ah. Also, I am doing a huge giveaway when I hit 25,000 uh, followers on Instagram. So if you're not following me, make sure to follow me so that you guys have a chance to win a huge, 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 huge giveaway with Fit Crunch, Everlast, Pretty Fit, and maybe some more sponsors and some gifts from me. So stay tuned. All right, it's 1.50. And I gotta get going, so I will catch you guys in the next clip. What do you guys think? I love them. This girl's wonderful. It's like I'm a new person, right? Yeah. So, just wanted to talk to you guys about something. <laughs> I've been thinking about this for the past two days or so. When you're not having a good day or things aren't going your way, because they most likely won't, not to be a Debbie Donner, but 
not every day is gonna be perfect. You gotta get yourself out of that slump. Typically, in the past, I tend to stay in that slump. Like, I'll just like get under my covers and I'll just like stay there and I just want all the food and I want everything and I just feel bad for myself and I just stay in that pity and for whatever reason it could be literally whatever reason but whatever it is that i'm going through right now it's not cool it's sucky and it's something that i don't want to be dealing with right now and it's not the health right now it's something totally different uh not associated with the health issues but it's just something that i wish was not happening to me and it is happening but you know instead of dwelling on it and thinking like why me why is this happening to me or why am i going through this and kind of just not doing anything. I'm actually doing something and doing things for me and you know, getting up and and not stopping my routine because in the past, pretty much just like stop life and that's something that I've learned, <laughs> finally, right? That life doesn't stop. You have to keep living your life regardless of what's happening and keep pushing through because at the end of the day, you're the one that's gonna make yourself happy. Nobody else is. And that's something that is very hard for me to accept, but it's something that I am accepting um, and something that I'm working towards because you are in this life by yourself. Um, you, are, you came into this life by yourself and you're gonna leave this life by yourself. And yes, you create relationships and friendships along the way, but you never know what's gonna happen down the road. So point of this little thing is that spend time with yourself find out what makes you happy yeah that's it really um i got pt done today i did cardio on my own i Tess was at work all day i got my eyelashes done i just some me time today which is much needed and that's it really i don't know where that came from it's just you know focus on yourself okay and um yeah stop and smell the flowers from time to time I don't know <laughs> I think I'm gonna close the vlog right here because it's already been two days thank you so much for watching this video guys thank you so much Everlast for sponsoring this video please give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it guys please subscribe if you haven't already and share this video with someone you think might benefit from it let me know what you guys want to see below if you guys have anything you've been thinking about let me know and I'll make sure to get on that hope I'm not missing anything I love you guys so much, and I will see you guys in the next video. Mwah. And I'm back, guys. I just wanted to show you what I just got. I was driving home, and I wanted to stop at the supermarket to get some flowers, but I was driving, and I saw a gentleman on the side of the street selling these beautiful, beautiful flowers, and I'm so glad I turned around and got them because they're absolutely perfect. If you know me, you know that my favorite flowers are daisies. These are the most beautiful flowers I have ever seen. Look at them. They're absolutely gorgeous. I know I don't know if you can see them with the, the plastic on them, but there they are, and I'm absolutely obsessed with them. Moral of the story: treat yourself. So I'm going to go home now, put them in water, and yeah, they're so beautiful. I'm so happy. All right, now I'm ending them here. All right, guys, have a great weekend. Love you. Mwah. Don't forget to subscribe, like, all that good stuff. Thank you, guys. I love you.